Hi, my name is Dr. Rain Rouse. I am a pediatric oncologist and hematologist and also work within the stem cell and bone marrow transplant unit at Texas Children's Hospital and Baylor College of Medicine. There are a lot of misperceptions about the entire process of donating bone marrow or stem cells. And it starts with, first, why do we need to actually diversify the registry? In general, there's a lack of diversity in the donor pool. What does this mean? This means that if an African-American person specifically has a clinical need for a bone marrow or stem cell transplant, they're much less likely to find a suitable match within the registry. This is why we need to diversify the registry, and only we can do that. Many people are unaware that identifying a suitable bone marrow or stem cell transplant matched is not simply based on blood type. If it were based on blood type, it would be a lot easier, but it's based on something much more complicated called tissue typing or HLA typing. This is actually linked to DNA and therefore linked to ethnicity. So African Americans are much more likely to identify a suitable match if there are more African Americans in the registry. As an African American leukemia lymphoma specialist and also a stem cell transplant doctor, every single day I encounter patients that unfortunately do not have a suitable match in the registry. This is a big deal. This truly impacts their ability to have a better outcome after a stem cell transplant and often can delay a potentially life-saving therapy. The reality is, as far as we've come in science and in medicine, every single day, we are still facing the challenge of not having suitable matches, predominantly for African-American patients who have leukemia, who have lymphoma, who have multiple myeloma, which disproportionately affects African-American patients. Not only do I see this on a daily basis with my patients, but I've also had family members need a bone marrow transplant and not have a suitable match in the family or in the registry. This is why it's so important that we lead the charge to diversify bone marrow and stem cell transplant registries. If you're a Caucasian or white person or someone of European ancestry, you have more than a 75% chance of identifying a suitable match for a bone marrow stem cell transplant from these registries. However, if you're African American, that drops drastically to less than 25% chance. Why? Because less than 10% of the registry is made up of African American donors. This means that you're less likely to find a match.